Tayshin, good evening. I'm Ellen Jones. Won't you come in? What lovely flowers. Thank you. I'll call Michael. Please make yourself at home. Hello, I'm so glad to meet you. Thomas told me so much about you. Did you know you were his favorite? No. I'm sorry I didn't get to see him again before he died. So, what brings you to Chicago? Uncle Thomas wanted me to know more about the city. Did he live around here? Yes, we became friends almost 20 years ago. He had moved here from Washington. He left Chicago a few years later and moved to the West Coast. Chicago winters were too harsh for him. He wanted more sun and warmer temperatures. Dinner is ready. Good evening. I'm Ellen Jones. Won't you come in? What lovely flowers. Thank you. I'll call Michael. Please make yourself at home. Hello, I'm so glad to meet you. Stephanie told me so much about you. Did you know you were her favorite? No. I'm sorry I didn't get to see her again before she died. So, what brings you to Chicago? Aunt Stephanie wanted me to know more about the city. Did she live around here? Yes, we became friends almost 20 years ago. She had moved here from Washington. She left Chicago a few years later and moved to the West Coast. Chicago winters were too harsh for her. She wanted more sun and warmer temperatures. Dinner is ready. Business California Dreaming, one of my favorite places in America, is the area around Monterey, California. I would like my nephew to visit Monterey the way I did, as a tourist. He should do the following, 1. Have lunch at a restaurant on Cannery Row. Sit at a table overlooking the water. Perhaps you'll be able to catch a glimpse of the famous sea otters. 2. Visit the Monterey Bay Aquarium. 3. Take the scenic 17, 17, mile drive. 4. Drive on Highway 1 down to Big Sur for a splendid view of the rugged California coastline. 5. On the return drive to Monterey, spend a night at the quaint Lamp Lighter Inn in beautiful Carmel by the sea. Ask for the Hansel and Gretel Cottage if you can get it. One of my favorite places in America is the area around Monterey, California. I would like my niece to visit Monterey the way I did, as a tourist. She should do the following, 1. Have lunch at a restaurant on Cannery Row. Sit at a table overlooking the water. Perhaps you'll be able to catch a glimpse of the famous sea otters. 2. Visit the Monterey Bay Aquarium. 3. Take the scenic 17, 17, mile drive. 4. Drive on Highway 1 down to Big Sur for a splendid view of the rugged California coastline. 5. On the return drive to Monterey, spend a night at the quaint Lamp Lighter Inn, in beautiful Carmel by the sea. Ask for the Hansel and Gretel Cottage if you can get it. A business lunch How did you know my uncle? Thomas and I founded a small company specializing in fine wines and foods. We worked together for about six years. He took care of finances, and I handled marketing and sales. He was a delight to work with. I didn't realize that he lived on the West Coast for six years. He didn't. We met in Chicago. As the company grew, I moved to California to be closer to our distributors. He eventually moved to Atlanta, as you know. How is the company doing? Very well, thank you. When Thomas became ill, he sold his shares of the company. So, what brings you to the States? My uncle wanted me to see the places in America that he loved. I'll receive an inheritance once I complete this trip and return to Atlanta. Interesting. Before you leave San Francisco, be sure you see the Golden Gate Bridge. Chinatown, and Sausalito. I've already been to Chinatown. I was just about to go see the bridge. Well, thanks for lunch. It was a pleasure meeting you. Action how did you know my aunt? 
Stephanie and I founded a small company specializing in fine wines and foods. We worked together for about six years. She took care of finances, and I handled marketing and sales. She was a delight to work with. I didn't realize that she lived on the West Coast for six years. She didn't. We met in Chicago. As the company grew, I moved to California to be closer to our distributors. She eventually moved to Atlanta, as you know. How is the company doing? Very well, thank you. When Stephanie became ill, she sold her shares of the company. So, what brings you to the States? My aunt wanted me to see the places in America that she loved. I'll receive an inheritance once I complete this trip and return to Atlanta. Interesting. Before you leave San Francisco, be sure you see the Golden Gate Bridge, Chinatown, and Sausalito. I've already been to Chinatown. I was just about to go see the bridge. Well, thanks for lunch. It was a pleasure meeting you. Business collecting your inheritance well, how did your trip go? It was great. I had no idea the US was so large. I thought I would never get back to Atlanta. Did you follow your uncle's instructions? I think so. Here are my receipts and the other items he wanted me to collect. I think everything is in order. Yes, I believe you have satisfied the conditions in your uncle's will. Here's your check. You can deposit it once you get home, if you want. Wow. I think I'll do that. I'll have a lot of credit card bills waiting for me. One thing is for sure, your English has really improved since you arrived. You're kind. I think it has, too. I wonder how I'll keep it up. With the money from your inheritance, you'll be able to come back to the US as often as you like, or go anywhere else in the world for that matter. Have a safe trip home. Thank you. I will be back. Well, how did your trip go? It was great. I had no idea the US was so large. I thought I would never get back to Atlanta. Did you follow your aunt's instructions? I think so. Here are my receipts and the other items she wanted me to collect. I think everything is in order. Yes, I believe you have satisfied the conditions in your aunt's will. Here's your check. You can deposit it once you get home, if you want. Wow. I think I'll do that. I'll have a lot of credit card bills waiting for me. One thing is for sure, your English has really improved since you arrived. You're kind. I think it has, too. I wonder how I'll keep it up. With the money from your inheritance, you'll be able to come back to the US as often as you like, or go anywhere else in the world for that matter. Have a safe trip home. Thank you. I will be back. Dining out high, will you be having lunch? Yes but I'm not very hungry. It's too hot outside. I know what you mean. It's a scorcher today. I'm not used to this kind of weather. I'm glad that everything is air conditioned here. Hi, my name is Carl and I'll be serving you today. Can I get you something to drink? Just water, please, with ice. Of course. I'll be back in a moment. Would you like to hear about our house specials? I think I'll just have a salad, bread, and a glass of white wine. Okay. What kind of wine? Our house wine is quite good. Fine, I'll have a glass of that. I'll be right back with your wine. Would you like some dessert? We have a delicious chocolate cheesecake. I don't think so. I'm on a diet. Just bring the check, please. Hi, will you be having lunch? Yes, but I'm not very hungry. It's too hot outside. I know what you mean. It's a scorcher today. I'm not used to this kind of weather. I'm glad that everything is air conditioned here. Hi, my name is Carl and I'll be serving you today. Can I get you something to drink? Just water, please, with ice. 
Of course. I'll be back in a moment. Would you like to hear about our house specials? I think I'll just have a salad, bread, and a glass of white wine. Okay. What kind of wine? Our house wine is quite good. Fine, I'll have a glass of that. I'll be right back with your wine. Would you like some dessert? We have a delicious chocolate cheesecake. I don't think so. I'm on a diet. Just bring the check, please. At the movies how many? One ticket please. That will be six dollars. What can I get for you? Popcorn, a Coke, and some of those chocolates there. You mean milk duds? Yes, that's right, a box of milk duds. Do you want classic Coke, Diet Coke, or Cherry Coke? Uh, classic Coke, I think. Would you like butter on your popcorn? Yes, thank you. Here you go. That'll be $4.50, please. Action how many? One ticket please. That will be $6. What can I get for you? Popcorn, a Coke, and some of those chocolates there. You mean milk duds? Yes, that's right, a box of milk duds. Do you want classic Coke, Diet Coke, or Cherry Coke? Uh, classic Coke, I think. Would you like butter on your popcorn? Yes, thank you. Here you go. That'll be $4.50, please. Shopping at the mall are you being helped? No, I'm not. I'm looking for gifts for my children, possibly t-shirts. For a girl or a boy? Both. I have a son and a daughter. What sizes do you need? I guess I'll need a large for my son and a medium for my daughter. How about the color? I think I'll get a light green shirt for my daughter and a navy blue one for my son. Are they easy to take care of? Yes, they're machine washable and shouldn't fade or shrink very much. Fine, I'll take the two shirts. How about something for your wife? Not right now. I'm going to look some more. Where's the fine jewelry department? Right over there, to the left. Are you being helped? No, I'm not. I'm looking for gifts for my children, possibly t-shirts. For a girl or a boy? Both. I have a son and a daughter. What sizes do you need? I guess I'll need a large for my son and a medium for my daughter. How about the color? I think I'll get a light green shirt for my daughter and a navy blue one for my son. Are they easy to take care of? Yes, they're machine washable and shouldn't fade or shrink very much. Fine, I'll take the two shirts. How about something for your husband? Not right now. I'm going to look some more. Where's the fine jewelry department? Right over there, to the left. Finding an apartment hello, I'm calling about an apartment. I'd like to rent a furnished, two-bedroom place. We have one furnished apartment left. It's air-conditioned and rents for $565 per month. Are the utilities included? The water is, but not the gas and electricity. That's a little more than I wanted to pay. Thanks anyway. Hello, Breezeway Manor Apartments, how may I help you? Do you have a furnished, two-bedroom apartment in the $400 range? Why yes, you're in luck. One just came open today. It goes for $450 per month, including water. Is it on the first or second floor? The first floor. It's very close to our swimming pool. Shall I hold it for you? I'll need one month's rent as a deposit as soon as possible. Yes, please do. I'll be right over. Hello, I'm calling about an apartment. I'd like to rent a furnished, two-bedroom place. We have one furnished apartment left. It's air-conditioned and rents for $575 per month. Are the utilities included? 
The water is, but not the gas and electricity. That's a little more than I wanted to pay. Thanks anyway. Hello, Breezeway Manor Apartments, how may I help you? Do you have a furnished, two-bedroom apartment in the $400 range? Why yes, you're in luck. One just came open today. It goes for $450 per month, including water. Is it on the first or second floor? The first floor. It's very close to our swimming pool. Shall I hold it for you? I'll need one month's rent as a deposit as soon as possible. Yes, please do. I'll be right over. Moving day good morning. Are you ready to see the apartment? Yes. Let's go inside. We'll start with the kitchen and dining room. Oh good, a refrigerator and stove. Is there a dishwasher, too? It's right over here, next to the sink. There's also a garbage disposal and a trash compactor. I'd like to take a look at the bedrooms and bath. Here are the bedrooms. They're connected by the bathroom. There's also a half bath off the living room. Which bedroom will you use? I like the one facing the pool. I'll use the other one for my study. Can I get a desk and chair for the study? I'll call the office and see if there are any in storage. I don't have a car. Is there a grocery store nearby? You're in luck. There's a supermarket down the street. It's about a 10 minute walk. Let's go back to my office and talk about your lease. Good morning. Are you ready to see the apartment? Yes. Let's go inside. We'll start with the kitchen and dining room. Oh good, a refrigerator and stove. Is there a dishwasher, too? It's right over here, next to the sink. There's also a garbage disposal and a trash compactor. I'd like to take a look at the bedrooms and bath. Here are the bedrooms. They're connected by the bathroom. There's also a half bath off the living room. Which bedroom will you use? I like the one facing the pool. I'll use the other one for my study. Can I get a desk and chair for the study? I'll call the office and see if there are any in storage. I don't have a car. Is there a grocery store nearby? You're in luck. There's a supermarket down the street. It's about a 10 minute walk. Let's go back to my office and talk about your lease. Shopping for groceries good morning. Can I weigh those for you? Yes. And how much are the tomatoes? 80 cents a pound. How many would you like? Three will be enough. I also want this head of lettuce. How much do I owe you? Oh, you don't pay here. You pay at the checkout counter when you leave. Sorry about that. Can I help you? I'd like a chicken, please. Would you like it whole or cut up? A whole fryer, please. I'll cut it up myself. Thanks. Yes, sir. I'd like a loaf of bread, please. Do you want rye, whole wheat, or white bread? I'll take the rye bread. Good morning. Can I weigh those for you? Yes. And how much are the tomatoes? 80 cents a pound. How many would you like? Three will be enough. I also want this head of lettuce. How much do I owe you? Oh, you don't pay here. You pay at the checkout counter when you leave. Sorry about that. Can I help you? I'd like a chicken, please. Would you like it whole or cut up? A whole fryer, please. I'll cut it up myself. Thanks. Yes, ma'am. I'd like a loaf of bread, please. Do you want rye, whole wheat, or white bread? I'll take the rye bread. At the laundry how does this washing machine work? You have to put four quarters in the slot, then add the detergent. I don't have any change. Where can I get some? There's a coin machine over there. It takes dollar bills. Do you have any detergent? 
Oh, no. I forgot to buy some at the supermarket. Can I borrow a cup? Sure. Take as much as you need. I've finished using the dryer, and there's still some time left if you want to dry your clothes. That's very kind. Thanks a lot. Don't mention it. Here's my business card if you need anything for yourself or your apartment. I manage a department store in the mall. We're having a big sale this week. Why don't you stop by sometime? Thank you. I'll try to. How does this washing machine work? You have to put four quarters in the slot, then add the detergent. I don't have any change. Where can I get some? There's a coin machine over there. It takes dollar bills. Do you have any detergent? Oh, no. I forgot to buy some at the supermarket. Can I borrow a cup? Sure. Take as much as you need. I've finished using the dryer, and there's still some time left if you want to dry your clothes. That's very kind. Thanks a lot. Don't mention it. Here's my business card if you need anything for yourself or your apartment. I manage a department store in the mall. We're having a big sale this week. Why don't you stop by sometime? Thank you. I'll try to. At the gas station story. Regular or super unleaded? Fill it up with regular, please. Could you also check the oil and the tires? Your oil is a little low. Shall I put in a quart? Okay. Would you mind cleaning the windshield, too? Sure. Where are you headed? To Washington. I've got to do some research there. I know nothing about the city. It's a great place, lots of good restaurants, museums, and stores. How long will you be there? I'm not sure yet. Probably several days. Have a safe trip. And don't miss the Smithsonian. Regular or super unleaded? Fill it up with regular, please. Could you also check the oil and the tires? Your oil is a little low. Shall I put in a quart? Okay. Would you mind cleaning the windshield, too? Sure. Where are you headed? To Washington. I've got to do some research there. I know nothing about the city. It's a great place, lots of good restaurants, museums, and stores. How long will you be there? I'm not sure yet. Probably several days. Have a safe trip. And don't miss the Smithsonian. I don't know what's wrong. It's a rental car. Maybe I should call the emergency number of the agency. Can I give you a lift to the service station at the next exit? Yes, if you don't mind. I think I'll call the rental agency there. I'm glad to help. It's part of the job. You're not from around here are you? No, I'm not an American. I'm visiting the U.S. for the first time. I've been to Atlanta, Georgia, and now I'm on my way to your nation's capital. You mean Washington? That's right. I've never been there. I'd like to go there one day. They say it's a lovely city. Hope the rest of your trip goes well. Thank you. You've been very helpful. I don't know what's wrong. It's a rental car. Maybe I should call the emergency number of the agency. Can I give you a lift to the service station at the next exit? Yes, if you don't mind. I think I'll call the rental agency there. I'm glad to help. It's part of the job. You're not from around here are you? No, I'm not an American. I'm visiting the US for the first time. I've been to Atlanta, Georgia. And now I'm on my way to your nation's capital. You mean Washington? That's right. I've never been there. I'd like to go there one day. They say it's a lovely city. Hope the rest of your trip goes well. Thank you. You've been very helpful. Everyday life a fender bender in Chicago story what the hell do you think you're doing? 
Sorry, I didn't see your turn signal until it was too late to stop. Hey, did you see what happened? Yes, I think so. Why? I'm going to call the police. You can tell them what you saw. This jerk ran right into me. Look at my bumper. It'll cost $1,000 to fix. Calm down. It was just one of those things. I have insurance. I really don't want to get involved. I'm from out of town. You're a witness, right? Can I have your name, address, and phone number? Yes, I saw what happened. Here's my passport. I'm not an American citizen. I've come to Chicago on business. Here's a contact number if you need to get in touch. Action what the hell do you think you're doing? Sorry, I didn't see your turn signal until it was too late to stop. Hey, did you see what happened? Yes, I think so. Why? I'm going to call the police. You can tell them what you saw. This jerk ran right into me. Look at my bumper. It'll cost $1,000 to fix. Calm down. It was just one of those things. I have insurance. I really don't want to get involved. I'm from out of town. You're a witness, right? Can I have your name, address, and phone number? Yes, I saw what happened. Here's my passport. I'm not an American citizen. I've come to Chicago on business. Here's a contact number if you need to get in touch. A household emergency what seems to be the trouble. Look, there's an inch of water on the floor. What a mess. Can you fix it? No sweat. Where's the main water valve? The what? Do you know where I can cut off the water? I think it's in the closet. What shall I do about all the water on the floor? Tell the manager to call a carpet cleaning service. How much is this going to cost? I'm pretty sure the apartment owners will cover it, as long as you didn't cause the problem yourself. How could I? I've been out of town for weeks. What a way to end my trip. What seems to be the trouble? Look, there's an inch of water on the floor. What a mess. Can you fix it? No sweat. Where's the main water valve? The what? Do you know where I can cut off the water? I think it's in the closet. What shall I do about all the water on the floor? Tell the manager to call a carpet cleaning service. How much is this going to cost? I'm pretty sure the apartment owners will cover it, as long as you didn't cause the problem yourself. How could I? I've been out of town for weeks. What a way to end my trip. Under the weather what seems to be the trouble. I feel terrible. I have a fever and chills. What's your temperature? 102 degrees. Have you taken anything for it? Just some aspirin. What should I do? I think you better see one of our doctors. You probably have an infection. Can you come right now? Yes, I'm on my way. I don't have any medical insurance. Is that all right? Don't worry. Our business office takes cash, personal checks, or credit cards. What seems to be the trouble? I feel terrible. I have a fever and chills. What's your temperature? 102 degrees. Have you taken anything for it? Just some aspirin. What should I do? I think you better see one of our doctors. You probably have an infection. Can you come right now? Yes, I'm on my way. I don't have any medical insurance. Is that all right? Don't worry. Our business office takes cash, personal checks, or credit cards.